Well, it's an annual holiday tradition, the fantastic forest at the Milwaukee County Zoo. Katie Kreklow is with the Zoological Society and joins us now. Good morning. Good, mor good morning, Sheldon. Hey, all right, so talk to us about this event and what we can expect. Sure, it really is fantastic. So if you can imagine, there are 66 live, real evergreen trees, and all of those trees were decorated by local youth groups. So we had 66 youth groups coming in to decorate these trees. And what we did is we divided them into the animal sections of the zoo. So this is the bird section. Um, and kids just get so creative. We just tell them, make the ornaments. So some used pine cones uh, to make a bird. Others used their hands, a handprint, to make a flamingo. So the creativity is just amazing and that's really what we wanna do. We wanna inspire creativity here and bring the community together. Wonderful, so how long are these uh, Christmas trees gonna be on display? Sure, you'll be able to see the trees um, all the way through the new year, so January 3rd. Uh, and that's a perfect time because it's gonna be frosty free week um, from Christmas until New Year's. So come in to the zoo for free, parking fees still apply. Um, and while you're here, the zoo also has something called the giving tree. So all of these ornaments are things that the animals want. So the kudu is looking for a gift card. Uh, so people can come in here, grab something, uh, see what the animal wants, buy that product and bring it into the zoo. And that really helps the animals at the zoo. Oh, I love that. A wonderful way to be festive and also help the zoo out at the same time. Exactly, and just a great way to get into the spirit. Excellent. Katie Kreklow, good to see you. Thank you so much for joining us. We're